Hello everyone. I did my makeup for a video before and I was like, whilst I got my makeup on, why not film another video because I can't go out in it, so why not film in it, you know? So I've ordered a few things from Pretty Little Thing. Um, not like a massive haul or anything. I was going to do like a huge haul, but then I sort of thought I always see them. I'll probably do one at some point, but I thought I'd try to do something a little bit different. Right, so it's not your bank account, is it? No, no. So I'm going to do a video on how to accessorise with little things, you know, like bougie on a budget. So this outfit, I'm trying to make it like universal, you know, so you can like, is that the right word? Universal? Well, you know what I mean either way. The first thing I bought was just a cream jumper dress. I really hope I like all these things because I haven't even tried them on. So if I don't like these things that I've bought, I'm going to be fuming because then this video is going to go tits up. So yeah, I've got this cream little knitted jumper dress thing that I'm going to put on. So you could obviously wear this on its own, but we're not going to. We're going to dress it up a little bit because that is the point of the video. Right, so I've got the dress on and I'm obsessed. It's so nice. I don't know how I'm going to show it in the camera. I'm going to have to stand on my bed, I think. I'm going to change lens on my camera so that I can zoom out more because this is all you can see of me right now. And that's like, oh my God, I'm not tall enough for this. So I'm going to have to stand on the bed for you to see this because I'm not tall enough for you to see the full fit. So, oh my god, a nail just came off. Oh. So I'm literally changing the lenses between each outfit here because the other one seems to make a noise when it's focusing and it's really irritating. So that one's just to show you the outfits. But um, yeah, I'm obsessed with this. I would actually wear this on its own. Obviously you can. It fits really nice. I got a size eight just because I didn't want it to be too short. Like I could have easily got away with a size six, I think, or even a size up. I don't think with baggy things like this, it matters too much what size you get, but I'm obsessed with this. So the next thing that I was gonna put on with it is, I got a cute little bag. I've wanted one of these for ages. I don't know why I haven't got one before now, but I feel like they just look so cute with any outfit. How cute is that? Oh my god, I love it. If I could ever adopt a bag, I would adopt this bag. So obviously you can either hold it, this little bit, or it comes with a little strap. I'm going to put that on because I probably would not hold this. Yeah, I'd probably wear this with the strap. This is so cute. It's hard to see it on the camera. I'll have to stand on my bed again in a minute. Oh, and change the lens. I love how the strap's like half chain. That is so me. I love chain. I feel like this would be so cute. Obviously, you'd have to be taking very minimal hand luggage but I feel like this would be so cute for the airport. I feel like this is quite an airport outfit anyway you know. Just depends whether you do actually go extra at the airport because I buy a whole new outfit for the airport. This is my kind of airport outfit. I just love it. So obviously that's accessory one. You don't have to wear all these accessories at the same time by the way. I'm just going to chuck them all in together so that you can see what they look like with the dress. So a cute little bag always makes it look like you've made a little bit more effort even if you've literally just slung it over your shoulder. So a little bit of effortless effort you know. So the next thing that I bought, I got some like boots, like patent boots. I'd seen these like everywhere at the moment and I really wanted some. I feel like they look so cute with like jeans or like an outfit like this just to like dress it. You can't, I mean, you're not really dressing it up or down with boots here. You're just sort of making it look better. Oh my God. They're unreal. These are so like not usual me. I would not usually go for things like this. But I've seen people wearing them on Instagram at the moment with like jeans or like a short dress or shorts. And they're just, oh. I'm so glad that I saw these on Instagram because I probably would never look at these on the website and buy these. I'd probably look at them and be like, ugh. But I'm obsessed. And I love the heel. Like, I feel like the heel makes them a bit more me. If they were flat, I'd probably still like them. But I think they'd be a bit less me. Maybe I'll get some flat ones as well. But I thought I'd start out with a heel because that's more me. And these are very different for me. So I'm going to put them on. I don't know how I'm going to show you these. But I'm going to put them on. So hopefully they fit. How am I going to do this? <laughs> Oh my god, I actually love them so much. Kind of hard to show you with the outfit. Even if I stood on my bed, you wouldn't be able to see the full length. So I'm just going to have to do a bit of gymnastics for you. This is all you can really get from it. <laughs> Why am I talking to you like this? These are my new favourite boots, everyone. Oh my god, how have I not, how have I not bought these before this? Like, oh, so far we have the dress, the bag and the shoes. But I have to do this to show you the outfit is not okay. So the next thing I bought, I kind of bought these as like a separate outfit, but I thought I'd try them with this too. So I've got 
they're just like lace tights but I put these in my basket after my basket did I put them in my basket I put these in when I got the boots because I thought lace tights with them boots would be a vibe so I had to do that but now I'm thinking about it I don't know whether they look right with this dress but I got this this is just like a leather jacket but it's like a baggy one but it comes with like a belt so you can like wear it as like a dress sort of thing so I kind of feel like this I'm going to try it on with this dress too but if it doesn't go then I'm going to try it on its own so this is like a dress and then with the tights with the boots that's what I've got in my head as a vibe right so just trying this with the jumper dress it looks better if it's like one shoulder off I don't know how it's going to look on its own but when it's like I feel like a fucking I don't know what I feel like I feel like a man I've kind of gone for like all weather accessories because I'm just loving that at the moment so I'll stand over so you can see this I'm gonna have to change the lens again so I just found myself on the bed showing it with the shoulder off and I realized it actually looked kind of weird so I'm gonna show you it with it on instead because I actually think it does look better the only thing that I don't like about wearing something thick underneath this jacket I kind of make sure it's buff and that's not the look I'm going for. I'm gonna obviously show you this now with the dress underneath and then I'll show you it with nothing underneath, just like as a dress on its own. So I've just put this jacket on as like a dress without the jumper dress underneath and I've put the tights and the boots on and it looks unreal, like this outfit is a bit of me. If you when I ordered it, I felt like I ordered a lot more. But um, obviously, the point of the video wasn't like a massive haul. It was more of a how to accessorize, like dress it up. So obviously, these outfits could both be worn to similar places. But obviously, I think the one that I'm wearing now is more dressy. But yeah, top tips for dressing up an outfit: I'd say a cute little bag always works. Obviously, these came with their own belts, so it's not like I could put a belt on to show you anything to dress it up. But belts always always make an outfit look better shoes obviously depending on where you're going you can always dress an outfit up or down with shoes so these boots obviously make this outfit look more dressy than if i was just wearing trainers but they're not too much i probably wouldn't go on a night out in these boots this is an outfit i'd probably wear if i was going for a meal or something like that but it's very extra i don't actually know where i'd wear this outfit to i'd probably wear it anywhere i'm quite extra like that and i'm not really fussed if i wear an outfit that's a bit extra to go get some breakfast with my dad but yeah the point of this video was to show that you don't have to spend loads and loads of money to make an outfit look expensive so like i literally bought everything here off pretty little thing and i just dressed it up with the bag and the boots and obviously they came with belts which help all you need to do to make your outfit look more bougie on a budget is accessorize and that's it really i really felt like this video was going to be longer but I guess that's all I have for you today. But yeah, let me know which outfit you prefer and if you'd want me to do more videos like this and if you want me to do like just clothing hauls of ordering loads of stuff. I hope you enjoyed it anyway and I hope it sort of helped. I'll tag everything below that I've bought in case any of you want to buy any of it. I'm not going to lie, I think my favourite buy was the boots. I'm obsessed with the boots. I love them so much. This is the only time I think I've ordered like a biggish sort of deliver from pretty little thing and liked everything so love that for me if you've got any questions about what size is somewhere or anything just ask me and i'll tag everything below so i'll see you in my next video <laughs>